victim's sexual escapades and now they've actually heard audio of the couple having phone sex. what does the tape mean for arias' defense though? does it help her? does it hurt her case? we're putting that phone sex tape in focus for you today the jurors heard it you're in trouble. um i cannot give you enough disclosures this morning or disclaimers i guess i should say. i'm christy paul thank you so much for being with us but ah please know that the tape that you're about to hear the discussion that we're going to hear is extremely graphic so children really they can't be in the room for this so if you need to do a little shuffling here um i i'm asking you to do it right now because we just want to make this as comfortable for everybody as we possibly can if there's even a possibility of doing that but you are going to hear things today oh have mercy uh one of the biggest moments in the jody arias murder trial so far obviously is this tape Yeah, which is like a horrible place in the summer. Yeah. 
Number two, their idea of social time is to get drunk. Uh, so no. is get drunk. Not everybody. The training would be awesome. I don't like those people. I respect them as business people, but that is about it. Really? They just don't have a soul. <laughs> Are you serious? They're godless. It's like look into their eyes. It's like dark. What about people like Tara and Mark Smith? Okay, Tara's nice, and maybe there's something there. But like, like I said, I respect them uh, for what they've done in their businesses. I like them as business associates. They don't have soul. <laughs>
Like you have? Um, yeah, we've had two or three hour sessions many times. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, back to the team freedom thing. Um, yes. Yeah, so I'm glad I intimidated the bathroom. <laughs> You're funny. I thought I was too, because I was right next to it. You're I did. And I put out like the I'll whip your A by when you say one word to me. <laughs> and I think you grabbed my ass like right in front of him when we were walking through the casino glass to Vegas about seven. We walked by, you're like, and you grabbed my butt and you're like, there was Dave. And I was like, what? Like, I love it when you grab my butt because it, cause it feels nice. <laughs> But you only do it like when you're trying to prove a point to somebody else. <laughs> That's not true, but I always do when I'm trying to prove a point to someone else. That's true. You, you cannot say I don't work that booty. Oh, never mind. You do know how to work the booty. <laughs> Your butt has got more attention than anyone on the face of the earth, come on, man. <laughs> well, it kind of screams for attention. It sticks out. <laughs> Yeah, well, I'm not the freaking tossed salad type, to be honest. 